Now to another big story we are following for you tonight. This cold weather temps are about to get really chilly tonight. Check out this snow. It's coming down hard at Arizona Snow Bowl with up to five inches in the forecast for tomorrow. And take a look at these snow filled photos of Flagstaff. Thanks so much to our 12 News Weather Watcher Patrick for sending those in. Such a gorgeous sight to see up in the high country. And we do have team coverage on this winter blast. Meteorologist Jamie Cagle is standing by with our forecast. But first, let's check in with our very own Erica Stapleton, who's up in Flagstaff for us. And Erica, what's it like up there? Hey guys, having been out here for the past four hours, I can tell you the snow is starting to taper off, but that does not mean it was not coming down harder earlier. We are in downtown Flagstaff right off of Route 66. And let me show you what's been accumulated. Last check with the National Weather Service, you can see this untouched snow here, about two inches in this area. So that's what people are dealing with out on the roads, out on the streets. And I wanna show you if you can come down here, some of that snow, if it gets packed down, it gets slushy. So it's a really, really wet snow. And that's gonna be something that drivers and people who are out and about walking are going to want to pay attention to. So looking out behind me here, again, we're off of Route 66. Visibility is getting better. It was much worse when we checked in at five o'clock. Looking down now, we can see probably two blocks ahead rather than just one. And of course it's getting darker out. So that makes things a little trickier too as people are navigating the roadways. We have started to see snow plows come by here in Flagstaff, pushing that snow out of the way again. It's not necessarily a lot of accumulation, but it is a sticky snow that can create problems out on the roadways. So what you need to know as you head into the night later today is that the snow is eventually going to taper off, but you do want to be careful if you are out here. It's going to get colder. It's going to be windy. So it's not just the snow that people have to worry about. It's all of the other elements as well. So just be careful if you're out here. Again, expected at least two inches of snow we confirmed with the weather service, but could be a little more than that. We'll let you know as things continue to develop here. For now, we're live in Flagstaff. Erica Stapleton, I'll send it back to you. All right, sounds good, Erica. I wonder if they make Sherpa-lined masks. <laughs> All right, let's give you a live look outside right now in downtown Phoenix. A beautiful night out right now. 57 degrees, but Jamie, that number is going to be dropping not only tonight, but throughout the week. Yeah, that 57 may be a daytime high as we look into that seven day forecast. But as we saw Erica up in Flagstaff again, that's still tapering off right now. It is expected to continue to drop. Now it won't be as impressive along parts of the rim, but there will be some pockets of that heavier snowfall. But right now as we go in a bit closer, it had been extending as far southwest as Prescott and now uh, again tapering off as you get into the Flagstaff area, but still some travel concerns, still some slick road possibility. Even as we go through these overnight hours, the winds still impressive in places like the plateau and down into the southeast part of the state. But our advisory has been expired, so these winds are expected to continue to die down. But taking a look at the current temperatures right now, again, 58 may be the daytime high coming up in that seven day forecast. We'll take a look at that as well as snowfall expectations in the full forecast.